Most of the wood blocks made in Taiwan are made of locally produced camphor wood, teak wood, Phoebe wood, and magnolia compressa. The wood is sawn into sheets of appropriate size and thickness, according to the size of the book following the wood grain. In order to maintain the flatness of the block surface, the cut pieces would be soaked in water and dried. Then both sides would be smoothed. Then the block surface would be coated with tea oil and then polished with squid grass. The text to be printed is transcribed by hand on thin papers by the text designer, and this process is called design. In the old days, woodblock printed books were completed by a team of text designers, carvers, and printing workers. The block is first coated with a thin layer of starch paste. Then the written side of the paper is pasted onto the block. And the paper is gently rubbed on the back to transfer the ink onto the block. After the paper is dry, the worker brushes off the top layer of paper with his fingertips, leaving only the ink of reverse pattern text on the surface of the block. This series of work is called transfer. Using a carving knife to carve the outline of each character from left to right, with the vertical strokes first and then the horizontal strokes. This process is called outline engravement. Next, use a chisel to cut out the blank space next to the outline engravement. So that the outlines of the characters or drawings would stand out, this process is also known as digging. Use a semicircular chisel to remove the blank space outside of the characters, or use the striking force of a mallet to gouge out the blank portions without any characters into a shallow groove. This procedure is called culling. Some people also call it emptying. Finally, trim the inner frame around the block and the line gaps on the block with a straight edge knife to make the text and drawing even clearer. After finishing this trimming work, which is called re-engraving, saw the block neatly all around. And trim the edges of the block with a planer to make it smooth. At this time, the engraving work of wood block is completed. Sample prints using red or blue ink can be provided for two final proofreads to ensure the quality of the print. When printing. Use a round ink brush or bristle brush with black ink, and brush it over the raised lines on the block. After covering the paper thereon, brush the back of the paper with a rake or a baren, and lift the paper off the block. Then the positive print will appear on the paper.